Hi there. So in this video, we are going to see SEO friendly URL structure in WordPress. So log into your WordPress and check this left hand side sidebar for settings tab. When you select that, you will find permalinks menu option. Click on that and it will take you to permalink settings. If you can see here, it has a few common settings. First says plain, second says day and time, third says month and name, fourth numeric, fifth post name, and finally custom structure. So by default, WordPress chooses this plain URL structure, which is not at all SEO friendly structure at all. So first thing, whenever you install your WordPress blog, make sure that you change this plane into one of these following. Now we will see which one's right in which scenario. Day and name is a good URL structure for nude sites or sites that publish content relevant to a particular date. In such cases, you'll find the date format and post name will be a good URL structure for those sites. So if you have a new site or a site that breaks in latest new snippet or some breaking news, then use day and name as your URL structure. Now the next is month and name. So this is handy for those organizations or blogs which publish some content on monthly basis. For example, there is one charity blog that publishes newsletter on monthly basis. So for them, such URL structure that has post name and month name can be good for their SEO. Then comes numeric. So whenever you are releasing content not relevant to particular date, but you release a lot of content on a regular basis, but it has more of a value in terms of breaking some latest content, but not exactly like news. So let's say information such as stock information or some finance related information, or let's say information from some sports, etc should have this numeric within their URL structure. And then finally comes post name. This is very good URL for those who want to publish evergreen content or those who want to have content not specific to time or month or year. For them, this URL structure is really good. Okay, apart from this, you can also customize your own URL structure using custom structure here. You simply have to remove this year or month, day or post name. So you can simply remove all that and keep only the post name. So that will be also one more SEO friendly URL structure. And once you make such selections, you can simply click on save changes. And once you do that, if your HT access allows you to do that setting, then changes will take place immediately. Do note that if you are migrating from one URL structure to another, then you may lose some social media shares. So for example, if you have a lot of Facebook shares for a particular post, then changing this permalink settings will cause that share to drop. However, still you can use some of the redirection plugins to get those shares back. So this was a short introduction on how to use permalinks for creating your SEO friendly URL structure in WordPress.